What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Black Hour, and welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Black Hour. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a big old breakfast sandwich because you know how you get up Saturday morning sometimes and you get hungry, man. You're sitting there watching Saturday morning cartoons, might be watching Alvin and the Chipmunks with your butt. Watch out! Cause here we come! got a craving for a big old breakfast, but you don't want to do a whole lot of cooking and a whole lot of crazy stuff, not like they used to do back in the day, you know, with the beaver cleaver in there. So, we're going to make something good, we're going to make something big, and we're going to make it delicious up for you. So, first thing you got to do, you want some breakfast. A breakfast ain't no breakfast, and to me, everything is better with bacon, bigger than bacon. So, that Wilbur. So, let's go ahead and get our bacon, and we're going to put that down in the pan, and just let it cook, you know, flip it over with your fork there, mister, and make sure you get a good meal. Crisps be on both sides. Now, don't dump out that bacon grease because that's what we're going to use to fry our eggs in there. So, those huevos. So, let's go ahead and take our egg, crack it in there. And you know, you cook your egg as long as you want to. Me, I like mine kind of runny. Kind of like, <laughs> kind of like the kids' nose, the little giants, you know. Don't be talking about my mama. So, let's go ahead and get our eggs. We got our eggs done. Now, I'm going to make just a little fried potatoes. And you're saying to yourself, like, oh, was that going on the same way? No, it's not. I just feel like making fried potatoes for breakfast. So I'm gonna do that. If you if you want to see how to make my fried potatoes, I'll put a link to that recipe that's my recipe for the fried potatoes down in my description, so you can check that out. So we would move right along to the biscuits because you got to have biscuits for this big old biscuit sandwich. And you're saying yourself like, oh, didn't you make homemade biscuits or something? Well, buddy, you know me. I got time for that shit. So I had the canned biscuits today, and you know what? Here, open the, that's scared the hell out of me, man, every time I try to open the canned biscuits because they pop on you and they scare the poop out of you, so <laughs> get your biscuit open, get your oven heated up, directions on the back of the can, you can't do it wrong, buddy, cook them biscuits until they're cold brown in your oven, yeah, you're ready to assemble our big bad sandwich, and that's good because I'm ready for it now, just uh, get your biscuit, one biscuit, and put it down on that plate, baby, now, we're gonna need some ham, just some old lunch meat ham, some old chico, some old pito. So, so, go ahead and put the ham on the bottom. Then, we're gonna put that egg on right on top of that thing, baby. Now, it wouldn't be none without no bacon, so let's give it some. So, put the bacon on there. Next, finally, I'm gonna put a piece of cheese on mine. You don't have to put no cheese on yours, you're saying, like, what? Cheese binds me up. Well, <laughs> I got a cure for that. It's called hot sauce and beer. And let me tell you, it won't be bound up no more. So, go ahead and get that cheese. Put it on top of there. Now, I'm going to put a little bit of hot sauce on mine because I like mine spicy, dicey. You can do that about me. Now, to me, one of the best hot sauces around is just that old fire sauce from Taco Bell. So if you got a packet of that, slap it on there, sir, if you want to do. So, it looks good. I'm ready to go. I think we're ready for a big breakfast site and a big breakfast. If I took this big breakfast sandwich tonight, don't you think so, Buckaroo? I do. I think it might be a fun. Buddy, the time has come. The big breakfast sandwich is done. And I'm having that first big breakfast bite from a damn self. And I gotta tell you, buddy, I think got some weight to it, too. Got that sauce dripping off there, got that egg on there. It smells delicious. So, without further ado, let's do it. What a mess. I know a drippy eggy mess, so you know that means it's good and it is. Alright, I took a big old bite. Man that ham. Get that ham on the bottom, it's giving that a good texture. You can't beat bacon and eggs for breakfast. That's really the way to go. Buttery, flaky, delicious biscuit. Holding it all together, that cheese holding it all together, and just a little kick with that Taco Bell fire sauce. So ring the bell, baby, ring my bell. So, I want to thank you for stopping by and having some bell breakfast with me. Well, not to, not no Taco Bell breakfast, my breakfast with a little Taco Bell. So, thank you for stopping by and watching another episode of Good Move Like Awa. Make sure to like, subscribe, follow me on social media. You can also watch all my other cooking videos right here on my YouTube channel now. 
Oh, excuse me. Time for another big old bite. So, stand back, buddy. Some heavy. I'm doing some heavy lifting.